this series of videos is um, kind of the behind the scenes of me prepping for teaching the bootstrap algebra uh, in fall of 2020. Um, if you're not familiar with uh, bootstrap uh, organization or bootstrap algebra, uh, go to bootstrapworld.org. Um, we're going to be under courses algebra and then we'll click here for the latest which is this time fall of 2020. I'm going to teach through this curriculum. I um, am a professional software developer, software communicator, uh, data scientist, and I've done a lot in the last 25 years, including learning many, many programming languages as a, um, an independent learner. I have taught through this curriculum before um, with one of my children in 2016. There's a, uh, another playlist on this channel um, with uh, the videos for those, and those are really specifically geared toward my child, and I communicate um, with them directly. So uh, here in 2020, I'm going to teach through it again in my house um, with uh, some learners here. Uh, in a more generic way that, that hopefully uh, anybody can, can pick up these videos and use. But if you want to teach through this stuff yourself and haven't done it before, if you're not a professional teacher, not a professional computer science person, um, the bootstrap materials are great. And um, so what I'm going to do as I prepare to teach through a lesson, I'm going to um, uh, screen capture all of that in a separate playlist. Um, so you can see how I'm preparing. Uh, if you're just an independent learner and want to learn through this material, you don't need to um, pay attention to this playlist. But if you want to, uh, if you're a, a parent um, or a teacher who doesn't have access to uh, Bootstrap as part of the curriculum uh, at your school, then um, hopefully it'll help you to just watch me prepare. As I've said, I have taught through this material. Um, previously, uh, at that time, um, I probably spent about three to four hours um, prepping for uh, the 20 minute video, which um, is not, not too uncommon. Um, I was uh, learning that programming language that's used uh, as part of this also, um, and I had a lot of stops and starts, but um, uh, so I've, I've put a lot of time into preparing this material. The 2020 version is laid out a little differently, so it's organized differently, but it uh, is essentially the same same material. So I don't have to put in put in near as much time this time uh, for each 20 to 30 minute lesson. Um, I'm expecting to spend 20 to 30 minutes. Um, uh, on this in this playlist uh, for each lesson to um, get everything set up, get the slides that are provided uh, set up the way that I want them to uh, walk through those, make sure that I um, um, know how remember how everything is laid out. I've already spent two to three hours going through um, all of the materials pretty you know quickly, just running through everything uh, and figuring how I'm going to uh, address my learners. And then I'm going to capture um, the specific prep for each lesson. So hopefully that's helpful if you are um, trying to prepare these yourself.